Hi there, welcome back to this Logic Pro 10.1 quick tip video. Another new feature of Logic Pro 10.1 is the ability to now very quickly turn on or off a series of plugins. And I noticed with drummer tracks, when you load up a drummer track, you get quite a lot of plugins on here. So I thought this might be a good way to show you how to use this new feature. So on this drummer region, we've got a series of plugins going on. We've got the multiband compressor, got some compression as a filter, bit crusher, as a dead delay, a reverb and some EQ. And say we're building up an effects chain and we're starting to get quite a lot of plugins on the channel and you just wanted to quickly hear what the channel was sounding like before you started applying all of those effects. You could go in and individually you could go like this, just mute them all. Previously you could do this and that doesn't take an awful long amount of time but what you can actually do now is with them all playing what you can actually do now is just click and drag so if I click over the left hand side of the plugin here where the on and off button is or the mute button you can just click and drag down and it just turns them all off or mutes all of these plugins and then if I just click and drag up again it turns them all back on or you could just the bottom three just mute them turn these two off so you know just clicking and dragging over the left hand side of this plugin here where you see the the mute button and you can just turn on or off a series of plugins in one go which is really cool very quick feature for just referencing audio say pre or post plugins so i hope you enjoyed that tutorial i hope you found it useful any questions please get in touch and thanks for watching cheers